What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Kai. Welcome back to another video, man. Before we kick things off, do me a favor. If you're new to the channel, go down and hit that subscribe button, man. Make sure you got that post notification bell turned on so you get notified about every single video. And leave this video a thumbs up if you are ready for NBA 2K22, man. We still don't have no news on that yet, but nevertheless, let's go ahead and get right into the video. Now, today we are starting kicking off a brand new series. It's called The Season. We're going to have multiple seasons. So in this, we'll be doing my NBA online with some friends. The goal is to win the championship. That's how you win the season. So in this season, we got two of my friends, one cousin, one of my homeboys. And since it's an odd number, two of us are going to be in the same conference and the other person is going to be in their own conference so we are going to spin the wheel to see who gets the first pick who gets the second pick and then obviously from that we'll know who gets the third pick we'll spin again to see who gets to be in the conference by themselves so hopefully we'll end up meeting in the finals and playing for that so it could be exciting so let's go ahead and get that wheel spin going for you guys i don't have it pulled up on screen but i, I have it off to the side where I could see it. So I'm gonna go ahead and spin the wheel and I'll let you guys know how the picks turn out. All right, guys, so I did end up getting the first pick for on the spin the wheel. So I'll end up picking first. I did not cheat. I listed their names first, so it would be fair, but it ended up landing on me. So I do have the first pick. Let's spin again and see who gets the second pick. All right, guys, so my friend Jack ended up getting the second pick. So now we're about to spin the wheel to see who gets to be in the conference by themselves. So this will just be one spin for this. So let's go ahead and find out. All right, guys, so my cousin ended up getting the, he ended up winning the spin to be in the conference by himself. So he will be in his own conference and me and my friend will be in another conference battling to see who will get that. Hopefully make it to the finals to play my cousin, but Nonetheless, let's go ahead and pick the teams and then get the draft rearranged in the right order. All right, guys, so we did end up picking our teams. My friend ended up picking the Nuggets, so I picked the team that was also in the same conference. I picked the Sun just to, they got some nice jerseys, and my cousin ended up picking the Wizards. So we got the draft order set. So now let's go ahead and invite them and get the draft going. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get into the draft. I'll be up with the first pick. And we'll go ahead and make our selection. Now, this is going to be our star player who we're going to, to create our team around. I think I'm going to go ahead and go for a dominant small forward. And I think I'm going to go ahead and pick KD. I would pick Brian, but we need somebody that could shoot. So I'm going to pick KD over Brian. So that's what I'm going to pick for my first pick. I'm going to show you guys my probably my first six or seven picks. And then I'll skip to the end and show you guys the full team of what we came out with. All right, guys, there we go. First pick, we ended up picking KD. So that's going to be our superstar on the team. And we'll see what other pieces we can get to fit in with KD and make this squad, man. All right, man, my homeboy ended up picking Kawhi. He a big Kawhi fan. So, I mean, that's a solid piece for his team, man. Kawhi is a dog. He can score good defensively, too. You know what I'm saying? They don't call him the claw for no reason. So that's a good addition to his squad. Let me see if I can predict, predict who my cousin is going to pick. Ah, he wait, whoa, 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 wait, that went too fast. I didn't even see who he picked. He got the Wizards. I feel like he, ah, uh, yeah, I knew he was gonna pick Steph. I thought he might have picked Brown, but I knew he was gonna pick Steph to get a shooter. So we gotta see who we gonna scout for our next position. Ben Simmons is still here, so we could go big if I really wanted to. We could get Drew Holiday. His premier defense is solid. Kimba is here. He get hurt too much. D'Angelo Russell is here, but his perimeter defense ain't, ain't all that. And D'Angelo Russell can't shoot. I could get Drew Holiday. CJ McCullum is here. Karis LeVert. Mm, I could get Anthony Edwards. I feel like Anthony Edwards would be solid. I really want to get Anthony Edwards. Anthony Edwards over CJ McCullum? Probably, because he got better defense and he more athletic. Sabonis is still there. Siakam is still here. Mm, this is tough. Uh, okay, I think I'm going to get Anthony Edwards. 
All right, man. So I think I'll probably end up going for my point guard next because I probably will have slim pickings the next round. So I'm going to go for my point guard next. I completely just skipped right over Jalen Brown. I could have got Jalen Brown for the shooting guard position. I didn't even like it threw me off because he's listed in the small forwards. They really just threw me off. All right, y'all, we are up next. I'm trying to see, scout out these shooting guards. Well, we already got a shooting guard, so, but I was looking to see if it was some point guards over here because, you know, they be switching stuff now. Like, see, Terry Rozier is right here. He ain't no shooting guard. He's a point guard. But these are the point guards that we have left to pick from. We could get Mike Conley. Probably end up getting him. D'Lo is, D'Angelo Russell is still here, but his defense is just like, it's a C minus. Cal Lowry is still here. He's six foot. Let me see. Mm, probably end up getting Mike Conley, honestly. Kimba is still here. Got Brogdon, just to see who else is still here. Got DeJounte Murray, he's six four, and his defense is nice. Uh, he can, Lonzo still here. Hmm. Lonzo 6'6". Six, six. I think I might get Lonzo. I think I might get Lonzo. Dante Graham is still here. Schroeder. Uh, I'm going to get Lonzo. I'm going to get Lonzo. All right, y'all. We got Lonzo. So, we, I think we looking pretty solid. We got, we got a young team with Lonzo and Anthony Edwards. So, I wanted to get a little bit of height. So we end up picking Lonzo. He could shoot. He's a solid shooter. I could have got Mike Conley. He could shoot a little better, but he's smaller. So I just ended up going with Lonzo. But we're going to see who we're going to get for our next pick. We probably end up getting a big man. Probably end up getting a power forward or another small forward and run KD at the four. But I don't know yet. We'll probably end up getting a center because that's probably the next most important thing that we need to grab. A, a solid big. So... Let's go ahead and scope out the centers, and I'll come back with y'all with the next pick. All right, y'all, it's on me. I was going to pick a center, man, but I think I might I might have to get Aaron Gordon and slide him at the four. I think I might have to get Aaron Gordon. Who is at the top of this lift? Gallinari. His inside defense ain't all that, though. But Aaron Gordon, he got nice inside defense, and he can shoot the ball. Miles Bridges, this is my guy right here, but his inside defense ain't there. Aaron Gordon, look at the, He got the inside defense, the perimeter defense, and he can shoot the ball. Why wouldn't I pick him? Let's see. He averaged 14 and 7, and then Millsap averaged 11 and 5. I'm going to have to go with Aaron Gordon on this one, man. Y'all, they threw me off. They picked my guy, um, James Wiseman. I was going to pick him as my center. And they threw me off. Bo Bo would be a nice center, but I ain't going to start him. So, see who at the top. Hopefully, Bo Bo is still there when I get a little bit. When I get another chance to pick him. But, uh, I got to find a backup now. I just ended up getting Mason Plumlee, man. I didn't. He was at the top of the list. So, technically, he was the best available or whatever. But, how they can't rebound. I, they really threw me off with that. But, hopefully, he do a solid job for us. He has some pretty nice uh, inside defense, and I think he can rebound. So hopefully he do his job. But now it's time to start picking reserves. So now we're just going after the best available. So next up, we'll end up looking at our six man. So I'll let y'all know who we pick for that. All right, guys, it's on us. We got playoff Rondo here. His three pointer is a B. His perimeter defense is a B plus. That wouldn't be a bad pick. We got Cole Anthony here. Anthony Simons. Uh, I don't know if I want to go a guard right now. Uh, let's see. Who else we got? Duncan Robinson wouldn't be bad, but his defense is so garbage. He's a tall shooter, though. Josh Richardson, Eric Bledsoe, Terrence Ross. I think I'm going to get Joe Harris. Joe Harris, you know Joe be going off. Yeah, we're going to go with Joe. All right, y'all, I'm just scouting right now, man. I'm scouting. I think I'm going to pick Bo Bo as the backup center, man. Look at the stats. He got, he can shoot the ball. He's 7'2", 
he got nice inside defense and he could rebound so that would be a nice backup center in my opinion he better than all the other available centers like best available is al horford but look at his rebounding like brooke lopez is solid but rebound ain't all that but i was thinking about also getting a guard because i don't have another point guard we still got patrick patrick beverly we got dennis the menace dennis would be a nice addition this perimeter defense is a c plus how all right y'all it's on me george hill is here drogic Alfred Payton wouldn't be a bad choice. He could play defense. Rondo wouldn't be a bad choice either. I'm... Uh, Tyus Jones is still here. I'm going to go ahead and go with KCP because he could shoot. He could shoot the ball and his perimeter defense is a B minus. So it's pretty solid. And then I'm going to hopefully bowl Boas there next time around. I honestly could have went with Eric Blesso, but I think KCP might have been a little taller, but it's all good. We're going to make it work regardless, and I'm going to go with Bobo for my next pick. Hopefully, he's still there, so I'm praying he'll still be there, and I'll go ahead and snatch Bobo up. And then that'll probably be the last pick I'll show you guys, and then I'll go ahead and show you the end result and let y'all know let y'all see what the final team is looking like and then that'll be it for episode one and episode two we'll get into our first game but we'll see what we do if bobo is still here or not all right y'all we made it to the end let me go ahead and show y'all the squad and we'll go ahead and do our lineup adjustment real quick i got kd it's our star man we got anthony edwards lonzo ball not Lamelo. We got Mason Plumley, Aaron Gordon, Joe Harris, Playoff Rondo, Boban, KCP, PJ Tucker, Iggy, Gary Harris, Rodney Hood, Bo Bo. But that's the squad, man. Let's go ahead and make our adjustment and see who we're going to have on the floor. Y'all could have probably guessed it already. We're going to have Lonzo starting Anthony Edwards. I'm not going to put Joe Harris in the starting lineup. I'm going to put... Aaron Gordon in the starting lineup so we can have some defense in there hmm, I'll pro I don't know if I want to keep Aaron Gordon at the small forward or move him to power forward KD is a little taller so we can move let me look at the roster real quick and KD's inside defense ain't all that so I'm probably going to move KD to the three and let Aaron Gordon defend the inside so that's the lineup we're going to go with man so that's it for this episode i hope you guys enjoyed the video man don't forget if you are new to the channel go down and hit that subscribe button make sure you got that post notification bell turned on so you don't miss out on the videos and we'll see y'all with episode two with our very first game against my friend so stay tuned peace